we occasionally get requests to log the actual name of the DXCC country on the log. Uh, I never fail to point out that this is not really necessary because it's displayed in the info form. It's displayed right here when you hold the mouse over. But anyway, if people want to know it, it is possible to do. We have another video on logging that information in real time. Uh, but someone asked how you go back and uh, update this field in batch. I have everything set up as per the other video. I'll link to that video in the description of this one. Uh, But to do that in batch, we go to uh, Tools, Advanced, and Database Commands. You can't really see it here because of the, uh, let me do it, move this over here. Tools, Advanced, Database Commands. Okay, and then it opens this up. And let's say Use Log. Okay, open the log form. Then we go to database files and we go to mass change, replace user defined field contents. Okay, so we want to replace DXCC name with and This is the um, um, expression that will get the name of the DXCC country out of the prefix table. That's the prefix object. That's just what logic uses any time it goes to look up anything from the prefix table. And telling it to get it by the, to get the, the DXCC, um, or to, to get the prefix record by the DXCC um, field and then return the DXCC happens to be the name of this field so we can kind of go to tools well it won't let me do that now but uh, uh oh okay okay there's a little quirk I discovered here if the DXCC field is blank I closed the um, mass change field, print DXCC, it's blank. Uh, that's going to throw an error in, internally if, if we're not pass, passing a DXCC to it. Or it's not going to ask, actually it's going to return a null value which, you know, won't help us here. So I'm going to skip to the next record. I need to get the, um, need to get the DXCC uh, record with DXCC uh, with something in it. So let me go back to do it again. Mass change Replace user defined field contents, DXCC name. Um, there's my expression. See, it likes it this time. Now, here's the trick. I want to replace only if, if the DXCC field it happens to be blank. I think I have a blank record in the log here. Or anyway, for some reason, DXCC didn't get filled in. Is not empty, okay? And if I say OK, OK, and it's running there. OK, so it finished running. And you see, there's the command it made. In fact, what you could do to get around all of the um, you know, having to find a, an empty record to use the form, you could just type or copy and paste this expression in. Let's go over here now to the um, – you see there, they're all filled in. Try to find one that's not United States. Uh, 
Oh wait, uh, not contest ID. Ah, oh, Canada. Okay. Sweden. Okay, so there we got it filled out. Um, thank you for watching, and uh, post on the forum if you have any questions about this.